style between the two cars, the nitro car and the alcohol funny car, are pretty much the same. Short wheelbase, you know, uh, the motor's in front of you, you're steering it a ton more than a dragster. You're looking through a windshield. All that part is pretty much the same. Where the, um, the G-forces and acceleration come in are completely different. In an alcohol car, you leave the starting line at anywhere from 65 to 7,000 RPM. So you're pretty up there, a car's vibrating, and that's where you get most of your momentum is in the beginning of the run of an alcohol car. And then towards the end, you're pretty much topped out, and that's all you're going to get with a nitro car. In the beginning, it's kind of gradual. It's still extremely fast, trust me. You get uh, quicker 60 foot times. But the difference is, is it keeps accelerating through the run, and then about 400 or something odd feet out there, it accelerates again. So, <laughs> yeah, where if with an alcohol funny car, in the beginning is where you get your acceleration. With a nitro funny car, it's all at the top end. But grad, I mean, it, get, it gets there from the beginning to the end, but at the end is where you really feel it, and you really need to stay on your toes.